All right, so I've actually done that on both of my eyes. So I'm just going to use my old paintbrush and then just spread it out all over my eye. Doesn't matter like how you spread it, just it should be spread it somehow. And I spread it under my eyebrow sometimes too. Just go, it's easier. And also use my finger to do it. Honestly, that's a little bit easier. By a little, I mean like that's easier. All right, so the eye is rubbed in, and I also do that just for on my eyes because I hate like your veins. I hate my veins on my eyes. It just feels, well, they don't feel weird. You can't feel them really too much. But, like, they just look weird with my makeup. I don't know why. But, so, yeah. I also am going to use the same Clinique thing. And I'm going to rub it um, just on the tip of my nose, my moustache area, <laughs> under my chin, and a spot on my cheeks. Okay, now I have that. I'm just going to use that basically to rub it with my finger. Alright. I made sure I already did this, but make sure that you wash your face before you put makeup on so that you don't have a dirty base underneath of you. So this is how it looks so far. All right, now this basically is away for now, um, but I'm going to now get into my eyeshadow and I'm just gonna open it real quick. It's hard to open with not using my thumb. Gosh. Okay, um, I got it open. It's a good thing. And I'm just basically going to wipe my paintbrush off. It doesn't really matter if there's stuff on it or anything. But I just like to wipe my stuff off. Then I'm going to use my finger for this one. I just use, I start off with the base one, like the white one. And I just put that all over my eye. Alrighty, so now I have that, and now that I'm going to just basically use this orangey color right here, and that one I just use on half of my eye. So I get that close up on half of my eye. So, as you can see right there, it's a little tricky to see, but I just put it on half of my eye. Okay, done that. Now I'm going to use this light brown. Just get, use my paintbrush. And then use, get, just dip it in the light brown. And then do dots at the, like the end ish of my eye. Okay, now I'm going to wipe that off. And then I'm going to use the dark brown actually now. This dark brown and just got pampers a little brown and just do one dot at the end of each eye. Okay, that's all I want to do. So, all I'm going to do for that, and then I'm actually just going to rub it in with this paintbrush. Or, no, I'm going to rub it in more with my hand. So, I do rub it at things in with my hand, it just feels like I can get the spas a lot easier. All right, so now I'm, I'm I think I'm done with that, but for just for now, but don't put it away completely. Now I'm going to use this, and 
I'm, this is the part that I'm going to use. I kind of use the crown for this a little bit. And then just, I basically just rub the crown in here. So, then I actually put that in like the crease in my of my eye. So it's a little glittery, but then also at the same time, just stays put. So. Right, so this way, right there, I mean right there, sorry guys. There, as you can see, a little bit. Just gonna do the same on the other eye. Alrighty, so I did that, and now this is basically gonna get put away. Um, and then I'm actually this is like the weird thing about, it, but I don't really have mascara, so I use this dark dark brown right here. I just rub my two fingers in it basically, rub my one finger in it, my pointer and my thumb. Then I just pinch it together. I pinch my eyelashes together. I mean, why pay for mascara when you can just use eyeshadow? And it actually stays on like mascara. Whoops, sorry, I have a dark thing in my eye. Um, stays on like mascara. But, so yeah. Sorry guys, I have a sink right next to me. So. It is somewhat hard to get it off if you don't like you know how to but how I do it is I get a wet like tissue and I put some um gold bond lotion on it, get it wet a little wetter wet again, then I just rub it where I won't need this stuff to come off. Okay. Okay, that is actually better. And I'm just going to use this kind of um, stuff again just to rub it in under there. I'm actually just going to do the same under my other eye. Just so there's no bags under my eyes. There aren't usually, but just in case. If you wake up late, then you don't have to watch this whole... If, like, you wake up late for school or something, all you really have to do is put eyeshadow on quickly. Eyeshadow blue like it doesn't really matter who you apply just i just have to make sure i just like to make sure it's on so it's basically for me eyeshadow blue eyelashes blush and sparkles that's all so but it takes a little while when you're trying to walk somebody through the steps on how you do your makeup it's a little trickier um and it takes a little longer so all right so I think I'm looking good under my eyes. So that does look a little better. It's more clear in this mirror. Um, but yeah. All right, so now I'm gonna get my blush brush and just rub it all in like crazy on my blush. Little blow, not too much there because I still want the blush on. So I'm gonna smile and just go, basically these are my points right here, right here, right here all up here. I sometimes rub a little on my nose so that it just blends a little bit better, but not too much. So I'm just gonna do my cheeks first, not my nose, and I'll go through my nose with you guys after. So I'm gonna smile. So I just wanna keep basically a good smile down so that when I actually do smile in person, then it'll look a little better. All right, so I'm done that, but now there's clumps of blush. What do I do? Well, I'm gonna basically do the same thing as I did before. So I'm just gonna use a washcloth because that's so much easier. Now I'm going to use this gold bond. No, 
water. All right, guys. So now that I've got that done. Okay, that's better. That is a lot better, actually. So. Sure there's not too much crimson. I also can use a little bit of pink eyeshadow, honestly, because it's like the same. I'm just gonna let it dry. Okay, just go light on it, blend it into your chin sometimes, and All right, so now I'm going to now do my other cheek. So that one, it's like almost impossible to get them the same, but it doesn't really matter. I'll be back when I'm finished, like getting them blended and everything. So I'll be back. Though.